Hey guys, Coat of Arms is back. We have got uh, something new here uh, that we're gonna check out today. It's the CAA MCK Micro Conversion Kit. Now what this kit is, it's a uh, polymer basically chassis that you can insert one of your favorite handguns into to convert it to, uh, basically to a submachine gun profile uh, type device. So uh, we have just received this from uh, MD Charlton. It's the CAA uh, MCK. Apparently this particular one that we're gonna look at for the first time today uh, is set up to receive a Glock. So uh, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna play around with it a bit, take some shots with the standard Gen 4 Glock 17, uh, see how we do with it. And then we're gonna put it into the uh, micro conversion kit and see how it improves our accuracy and uh, maybe talk a bit about uh, functionality of the MCK kit as well. No mag. Clear. Insert the pistol. Seat it in. Slide it forward. And then this trap door here. We're gonna push it down and then slide it forward to lock it in. First impressions, it uh, it feels really compact, but uh, I'm actually digging this uh, thumb rest up here. As you, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it naturally contours to your hand. So my index finger is wrapping around there nice, other fingers there, and I'm just resting my thumb. We're gonna do a fun little, uh, fun little test here. We're gonna put some mags down range. We're gonna, uh, for coolness, use our 33 round mag pin to 10, but uh, you know, it looks fun. You know, running our Glock inside the CAA kit, and then we're gonna take it out of the kit and uh, see uh, how, if our accuracy degrades at all. Uh, we're shooting at 25 yards right now. I just wanna note, uh, we just literally pulled this out of the box, so I don't know where these sights are at, but uh, hopefully they're on paper and we can uh, get an idea of how it groups. Once you got comfortable, you had, you had one flyer in each mag, and they actually, you almost put them in the same spot. But once you settled in, uh, you dialed it in, you started to group in this general area here. How many shots are on that one really tight group right there? At least four. Maybe I'll try to do the same thing with just the pistol this time. Yep. And uh, we'll see kind of what the result is. Yep, and then I'll try these two targets here. Perfect. I'm gonna do pistol, low right target. All right guys, for the second mag, I am gonna uh, change apertures here. So I'm just gonna flip it up. Uh, hopefully that tightens up the group a little bit. Well, now that Corey and I have both shot the pistol standalone and within the kit, and now I'm actually looking at our targets, and for both of us, using the kit has probably decreased our group by like 60 to 70%. And that's for both of us. I can tell myself for sure, I've brought it in probably four or five inches, and Corey has probably brought his in uh, almost six inches. I think it's actually a really cool piece of kit. You can buy this this kit for you know around the two hundred dollar mark. It's super compact. You know you can adapt it to however you want. You know red dot that sort of thing, um, and it just turns your you know your stock pistol into something really fun. Basically uh, an SBR, which is incredible. I could probably see myself just leaving this Glock in the kit all the time and always having a nine mil sub gun ready to go. Special thanks to uh, Silverdale Gun Club for letting us uh, shoot and film here. Thanks to Peter over at MB Charlton for uh, loaning us this uh, CA kit to uh, check it out and uh, report back to you guys. You better bet we're gonna see some more footage of this thing in the future.